can I? Oh, I can probably go inside the mansion. Let's just let's try at least. Maybe there's stuff I can get. We don't own many coats in these tropical climes. This clock appears to be stuck at 610. The pendulum isn't moving either. <gasps> maybe we're stuck in some kind of temporal anomaly where time stands still forever. Or maybe the clock hasn't been wound in three months. That could work too. Groovy banner. For some reason, it makes me want to write a hog. Yeah. <laughs> I love chess, especially the horsies. Elaine'd kill me if I got dirt on her family banner. I'm no expert, but this china doesn't seem very nice. Don't even think about touching the china guy brush. Who's touching it? I'm not touching it. No, sir, not me. Nah, most of this stuff is Elaine's. I wouldn't want to deprive her of her favorite trinkets. Elaine really loves these plates for some reason. Dang it, I hate how the thing... I like this kind of commode better than the one in the bathroom. The one made of ugh, porcelain. Nah, most of this stuff is Elaine's. I wouldn't want to deprive her of her favorite trinkets. Government paper. Yeah. Give government paper to fine China. Seem, seems like, seems, seems appropriate. Let's do that. I'm not sure if Elaine would approve of that. Put that away. The header says, Melee Government Employment Contract. I get it. Did I get it? I did. So I got, now I got, now I got two things. I got 
I got a government contract form and I've got a government paper, whatever, whatever that does. She reminds you of your sister? Why? a pirate governor or a small of a small island declared yeah that's what she is i can't it's the door to our bedroom <laughs> this is no time to sleep okay I mean, who wasn't a pirate governor of a small island and declared legally yet dead? I mean, right. It's the door to the kitchen. I would, but for some reason, Elaine has locked it up. Should I talk to Elaine? Ahoy there, matey. What are you doing here, Guybrush? Did you see the way I rid us of that cataclysmic catapult? I always knew you had it in you to destroy heavy machinery, my chaotic little pet. Unfortunately, that's only a stopgap measure. We have to find a more permanent solution. We can make a public offering of the island and retire on the proceeds. You mean like Melee.com? That's stealing, even for pirates. could launch a full-scale attack on City Hall. Hold the town hostage, I say. Arr, arr. It's not very civilized, honey bear. Besides, I wouldn't want you to get hurt. I'm too young to be a widow. My ideas are all too ahead of their time to be taken seriously. Thanks for trying to help, Guybrush, but I, I think we need to stick to the current plan. I'll get right on it. I'm having a little trouble getting a ship. What kind of trouble? I don't have the authority to requisition one. Can you believe that? Me! There must be a bunch of new people around here since we left. Here, take this. It should give you an air of authority. 
What's this doohickey? It's the official gubernatorial symbol of Melee Island. It conveys the authority of the Office of Governor. It also gets the holder into some pretty great parties. <laughs> A true pirate doesn't need some gubernatorial symbol to prove he commands respect. Yes, well, all the same, I, I think you'd better take it. Oh, all right. Oh, does this mean I get to run the island now? I've got some revolutionary ideas about subsidized childcare. Just give it back the minute you return from Lucre Island. Can I have some, Can money? I have some money? Why? I'm not sure, but it always seems as though I could use a few hundred pieces of eight on my adventures. Well, I'd like to help, sweetheart, but we're kind of strapped for cash right now. Besides, what happened to your monthly allowance? I blew it all gambling on spitting contests on Booty Island. Well, then I'm sorry, my dear. It's time you learned an important lesson about budgeting. Oh, shucks. I really think I'll need some money on yeah, this Yeah, give trip. me some not money. until you learn how to spend your money responsibly. Nobody wants to be on my crew. Ask nice and don't make any ridiculous promises. Yeah, you should use that in your campaign. I'll leave the crew selection to you, my dearest, and you can leave the campaign management to me. Is there anything else? I'll let you concentrate on your campaign. Thanks. All right, I think I got a boat. Here. I don't think she'd like that. All right. All right. All right let's put that away. It's a portrait of Elaine's grandfather, Horatio T. Marley. This must have been painted years before his yacht was sucked into a whirlpool off the coast of Australia 20 or so years ago. Never to be seen again. No, that sofa doesn't have enough lower back support. Wouldn't want to end up becoming a hunchback and looking abnormal. How could a mere painting capture the essence Who's of my Who's played this game oh, before? Oh, that's so sweet, Guybrush. Now get back to work. Uh, yes, dear. Let's see if we can get a boat. What do you say? Is this some kind of joke? What? This contract is not even being signed by the governor. <laughs> we may be down on our luck, pirates, but we're not stupid. Come back when you've got a signed contract.
Okay. How do I get out of here? How do I get to how do I get out of here? Oh, this way. Okay, I wanna give you the thing. I told you, you don't have the authority to... Check this out. What's this? The gubernatorial seal of Melee Island. Oh, I see. Mm-hmm. Well, I guess you are an important person. Right this way, Mrs. Marley. Let me show you to your ship. Wait, my name's Mrs. Marley? Interesting. Is the dainty lady. It's pink. You've obviously got a seaman's eye for nautical details. But but it's pink. Now there are a couple of regulations that I I'm required to, that explain ship. to you. First, bring it back in the same or better condition as it is now. Second, life preservers are to be worn by all crew and passengers at all times. Finally, this vehicle is to be used for official business only. So no joyriding. Can I go now? Well, I'd love to hang out here on the docks with you all day. Actually, that's a lie. I can't stand to be near you. Bye. Oh, and enjoy your voyages on the dainty lady. I knew we'd get that ship. Didn't you know that? Didn't you know we were going to get that ship? Because I did. Got a ship now. Okay, now we need to get a crew. Who would be? Are we gonna get work? Are we gonna get the same crew we had from the first Monkey Island?
Oh no! Oh, okay, I went in. I was like, I thought I was stuck. Wait, she's over here now. Oh no. Hello, governor. What are you doing here, Guybrush? Nobody wants to be on my crew. I really don't have time to help you with that. Is there anything else? you concentrate on your campaign. Thanks. I thought maybe she could sign the thing, but she's not going to sign the thing, apparently. Okay, she is signing things, so maybe we can, like, somehow sneak it in there, you know? You know, maybe I should look at these and figure out what they are before I bug a lane with them. The header says, Melee Government Employment Contract. Cushy edition. What's this for? I needed to convince reluctant rap scallions to join my crew. Darling, can't you just use your blinding charisma to cajole them into joining you? I think I used up all my charisma on the honeymoon. Alright, let me sign it. That was easy. I got the girl in the last game. Well, what's this one? The header says, Melee Government Employment Contract. Let me guess. Another government bribe? I prefer the term state-sponsored incentive. When you get back from Lucre Island, we're going to have a long talk about civic ethics. All right, let me sign it. the cushy the, we got the cushy one and the other one okay
There they are. Let's give them this contract thingy. Here we go. Oh wait, I got it. I got Ahoy it. again. What is it now? We got some heavy duty begging to attend to. Be seeing ya. Not if we see you first. <laughs> Wow, you actually got us a signed contract. Well, let's see. Mm-hmm. Yes. Ah, yes. Good. Aha! Uh -huh. Um, Carla, do you even know what half of this stuff means? Not a clue. But look, it says cushy in the title. Wait, all right then. All right, Threepwood, you've got yourself a crew. Yes! We got ourselves a crew. Do we need another crew member or are we done? Is that is that is that good? Ahoy again. What is it now? So, are you looking forward to our voyage? The horror! The horror! We'll meet you at the shipyards once you've got a ship. Never thought I'd say that again. Be seeing ya. Not if we see you first. <laughs> Baby. All right. So are we good? Are we good or do we need another crew member? Are we good? I think there's this thing about maybe needing money, but I'm not sure. Dang it. That's the second most beautiful figurehead I've ever seen. Hey, she's got pierced ears. Why would anyone put earrings on a ship's figurehead? So how do how do we how do we leave now? Yes, I'm asking rhetorical questions at the moment. I don't think she'd like that. I'm asking rhetorical questions. Probably a good idea to keep a couple of those near the grog machine. Nobody needs saving at the moment. Uh, 
I can't use this machine. I don't have any money. I can't use this machine. I'm not picking that up. I sure could go for a nice, refreshing grog right now. It's empty. I'm not picking that up. It's me again. Go away. Hey, look, a full moon. Yes, I am. What am I supposed to do with this? Give the con let's give the contract to the moon. I'm not sure if Elaine would approve of that. All right. to think I'm thinking let's give the sign contract to melee town I'm not sure if Elaine would approve of that okay I don't know what to do now I think I might need, I think I mean, you know, I think I might need a hint. I don't know. I don't know if I do. I feel like we need to do something with a signed job contract, but I don't know what. Let's look at it. The header says melee government employment contract. It's just a signed employment contract. Where do you think we use this at? Who wants an employment contract? He'd like that. I don't think he'd like that. Ahoy again, mateys. Excuse me. Hey. Why aren't you playing insult dart throwing? The official Tri Island Dart Throwing Semi Professional League rulebook clearly states all dart competitions must be won by dart throwing skill, not by any other means such as bribery, insults, threats, or otherwise. Are you sure you won't join my crew? Nah. Nah. I bet you can't hit another one on the first shot. Name it and all in.
<laughs> I bet you can't hit that guy over there. Ha! That's easy. Ow! Hey, you're pretty good. I bet you can't hit another one on the first shot. Name it and all it. There's no way you'll be able to hit the center of that life preserver on the kitchen door. Watch the master at work. Impressive. Well, I guess I'll be shoving off now. Are you still here? Okay, does that get us a dart? You think? Does that get us a dart that we can take? It's not. Dang it. Not even a life preserver will save what lies beyond that door. Can I get a refill on these pretzels? Sorry. You'll we'll have to finish the ones you've got there first. But I want more. Quit your whining. I want more. How'd you like to join a crew of courageous pirates on a dangerous quest? Ooh, that sounds like fun. Great. But I should really check with my boss first. Hey, boss! What? Can I have a few days off to join Mr. Threepwood here on a swashbuckling adventure? Are you out of your grog addled mind? No. I guess I can't go. Damn. Dang it. Do you know anything more about this Australian developer? Mm, not really. I'd surely love to give him a piece of my mind, though. No, really, grog me. No, really, ID. What, don't I look like I'm 14? Actually, you look like you're about 15. But we're carding anyone who looks under 23 just to be safe. Uh, I've got to go. Right, well, use my well, thing. Yeah. I don't think you'd like that. Okay, or not. Hmm, what do we need to do? 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 I don't think he'd like that. I'm not sure if Elaine would approve of that. There's a kettle. Perfect for popcorn. There's no way that's gonna fit in my pants. Oh, the kettle at the stove. Oh, okay.
All right, what do we need to do? What's our next move? Oh, the timer's not starting. I can come here. Wait, what if I go in here? What happens? I wasn't able to go in there before. Oh, it just goes out another door. Okay. Yeah. Boom. We've got this place, but... Perhaps I've become desensitized, but this pile of human bones no longer sickens me as it once did. but I'm also asking for hints in a, in a way. There's something I need in there. Ladder. Oh, climb ladder. Nothing interesting up here. Okay, that didn't work. Perhaps I've become desensitized, but this pile of human bones no longer sickens me as it once did. Oh, okay. <laughs> I thought you were talking about the game. I was like, oh, I'm close to something, what? I mean, I, honestly, this game's somewhat annoying me. Just the interface is not good. And, uh, like, I think I can, I mean, I can probably brute force it. But the problem is, unlike pointing and clicking where you can just click on the whole screen, you have to actually walk around and find stuff to use. And I don't like that. Like, we got, we got a got, we got the dart players. I don't know if we need to use them um, to get something, but I'm gonna... I feel like we, I missed something. Like, do I need another crew member or what? I do need another crew member. Okay. I'm back. That you are. Are you sure you can't join my crew? I'll check. Hey, boss! Don't even think about it, bucko. He sounds pretty adamant. Is that what we need uh, to do? I gotta go. Right, well, go out and do that. We need to talk to the boss. Who's the boss? Is this guy the boss? Or is this guy in the kitchen? 
I don't think... Oh, big... The big cheese? Is that why his name's Cheese? Because he's the big cheese? He's like the boss? Hello again, Mr. Cheese. Yes? No. How would you like to join my crew of mighty pirates, Mr. Cheese? And what, pray tell, might I be finding myself doing if I joined this crew of mighty pirates? You'd be traveling to Lucre Island with a crew of Cretanous Buccaneers to meet with my wife's lawyers. Now that sounds like a worthy mission for a mighty pirate navigator like myself. Really? I. The seas around Lucre Island are very treacherous and can only be navigated by a skilled sailor. I'd love to face that challenge, but... But what? I can't. Why not? Because if I leave my bar for too long, it'll be stolen out from under me. You're the owner of the scum bar? I, the one and only. Big cheese. Okay, okay. Okay! What makes you think that the scum bar is going to be stolen? Well, it's like this. I've been fighting off a hostile takeover bid from an Australian land developer. Come again? You heard me. A greedy Australian is making a grab for my bar. With guns and swords and cannons? Worse, with insults, jibes and mockeries. It's taken all of my insult arm wrestling skill to keep him at bay. Gosh, if it weren't for the whole wife being declared dead thing, I'd say that was the strangest thing I'd heard all week. Okay. Is there something I could do to convince you to navigate my... Is there something I could do to convince you to navigate my ship to Lucre Island? I'm open to persuasion. What do you have in mind? If I beat you at insult arm wrestling, will you be my navigator? Hmm, that's an interesting proposition, Threepwood. It is? I mean, of course it is. How about this? If you beat me, I'll be your navigator. Great! But only if you teach me some new insults. Agreed. Well then, let's see what you've got. Uh, today, by myself, 12 people I've beaten. I am rubber. You are glue. Uh, give up now or I'll crush you like a grape. I would if it would stop your whining. Today, by myself, 12 people I've beaten. Hey, you can't, you can't bring it back at me. From the size of your gut, I guess they were eaten. Ah. I've got muscles in places you've never even heard of. Oh, it's too bad none of them are in your arms. My 98-year-old grandmother has bigger arms than you. Why, you studying to be a nurse? Give up now or <laughs> I'll crush you good. like a grape. Okay, I know, I know that one. I would if it would stop your whining. Ah, my stupefying strength will shatter your own into a million pieces. What surprise you could count that high. Ugh. Do I see quivers of agony dance on your lip? Uh, I thought that the bean dip had a strange taste. Uh, 
That wasn't right. I got muscles in places you've never even heard of. <laughs> it's too bad none of them are in your arms. My 98-year-old grandmother has bigger arms than you. Oh, yeah? Oh, yeah? Uh, I'm gonna put your arm in a sling. Why? Are you studying to be a nurse? My hey, Harry Squishmas. strength will shatter your all the Thanks for the raid. Wait, what? I, I missed, I missed the insult. Uh, could you repeat that? My stupefying strength will shatter your order into a million pieces. Oh, I'm surprised you can count that high. Uh, I'm surprised you can count that high. How is Return to Monkey Island? We're playing the game, the non point and click game Escape from Monkey Island, which doesn't have a mouse, so there's no pointing. I haven't played it. No spoilers. We're trying to get through all the Monkey Island games um, until we play it. So I want to play this one. I want to play uh, Tales of Monkey Island, and then we're gonna we're gonna play it in the future. So wait, what did he say? Oh, I'm the one doing the insult. Your knuckles will I'll grind to a splintery paste. Yeah, uh, your knuckles I'll grind into a splintery paste. I thought that the bean dip had strange taste. I'm gonna put your arm in a sling. Uh, why, you studying to be a nurse? People consider my fists lethal weapons. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> my forearms have been mistaken for tree trunks. Oh, how appropriate. You fight like a cow. I won. You did. Fair and square. Congratulations. You got yourself a navigator. Is that the sheep? It doesn't look very seaworthy. At least it doesn't smell like monkeys. Are you guys ready to go? I can't. Whatever. No. Don't make me slap you, Otis. Fine. Let's get this over with. Then we're off to Luker Island in search of high adventure and a legally binding restraining order. It'll all end in tears. Mark my words. Mr. Cheese, shouldn't we steer away from those dark, portentous clouds? Nonsense, Captain. A little rain never hurt anyone. <laughs> Button down Leap for the silent running. Short and sound! Clear the scoopers! Get your hands off me! Sorry, baby. Well, there you go, Mr. Marley. Luker Island. Ah, Luker Town. The largest urban center in the Tri-Island area. Thanks, Mr. Cheese. Uh, next time you think we can get here with a little less drama? Oh, no. There's not going to be a next time, is there? Better not be. Once was enough. Okay, I'm going into town. You guys stay here and watch the ship. Oh, sure. I see how it is. The captain gets to make all the decisions. Yeah, that's, that's pretty much it. 